All right, you guys. So you clicked on this video, you saw the title, and you were a little interested. And you know what? I hope and I'm glad that you are. So I'm trying to find ways of, you know, mixing up the content for Cold War Year 2. Because, I mean, dude, I've done it all, man. I've done literally stat breakdown videos. We've done the serious side of Call of Duty as far as that goes. But now it's time to have some fun, dude. And we got to mix it up every now and then. So I was thinking, okay, you know what? Sweating in Cold War in 2022? Like, come on, man. We're supposed to be having fun with the game. Don't get me wrong. I still have fun with the game. But... A lot of my matches are pretty damn sweaty and I figured, you know what? I'm going to purposely uh, log in at night and I'm going to look for level 1000s and I'm going to see how I do against these guys. And keep in mind, I'm playing solo, so it's not like I got teammates, you know, helping me out, playing the objective and stuff like that, playing anchor, whatever you want to call it. So I think this would be a very entertaining series. So we are hunting for sweats in cold war in 2022 if you guys like this idea you know this is just for your entertainment purposes only and i'm not going to guarantee every single match i'm going to show out but i am going to try my absolute best i'm not the best call of duty player out there i would consider myself more on the above average on the casual tier of things and uh, that's what really makes this channel great in my opinion is because a lot of you guys can relate to my play style you know i i focus more on strategy who wants it more etc etc not so much uh you know showcasing oh like 1000 kills for example something that's super unrealistic and un unrelatable but here man i'm trying to keep it real with you guys hopefully you guys do enjoy the video and also leave a like on the video smash that like button dude smash that like button i'm always looking at the ratings and i'm always looking at the comments let me know down below in the comments if you want me to continue making cold war videos and i will continue doing that man i really appreciate everybody who is contributing to the activity on this channel on the cold war content so keep doing it man don't be shy reading all the comments and i really appreciate reading through them and all the support you guys have been showing me this year man it really does mean a lot to me so without further ado let's get into today's gameplay it's turbo time all right y'all we're doing this right now we're going on a mission to find the sweatiest of sweats you got to play at night you literally got to play at night lobbies are going to be 100 percent harder because less people are playing which means skill based matchmaking is a little bit more strict the sweats are always on late at night casuals yeah, they don't get on late at night shit. so we got two level 1000s here in the lobby yeah man we're gonna try our best to hold our own they might be on our team they might not of course we want them to be on the other team obviously that's the point of this video let's hope so i'm gonna be putting on my Try hard class set. We're going to be using the tech nine. I know, I know, I know. Turbo man, come on, man. How can you stoop so low? But dude, trust me. Got to do what I got to do. Anyways, where is it? All right. So I don't actually have it. So I guess I'll be using the LC 10, which is going to be a little bit more entertaining, obviously, since my gunfights are going to be a little bit harder to end quicker. So uh, yeah, they're on the other team. Perfect. So. Uh, playing on slums, one of my favorite maps. I probably should have changed my score streaks to uh, some more uh, assault score streaks. But hey, you know what? Let's do it. Play some hard point here. Let's get to it. Not going to talk too much. Just leave a comment down below. Let me know you want more Cold War. And leave a like on this video as well. Your feedback is much appreciated. Oh, dude. You almost got turned on right there. I was mid-animation. Come on. Ah, it's gonna be tough, tough competition, guys. Come on, guys, where is this guy? Someone's behind us here. Heard his footsteps. Dude, how did you know I was gonna be around that corner? Look at that. Bro, he was on the other side of the map already. Dude, that's kind of sus, man. I'm not going to lie. That is actually kind of sus. That is a little sus. Jeez, what? Yo, what? Are there actually, like, hackers in Cold War right now? Do you guys know anything about that? I mean, I'm not taking anything from the guy whatsoever, but that just looks super sus to me. This guy's too good with the EM2. It's another gun I need to use again. Oh boy. Come on, get him, teammate. Good flank, good flank. 
Or just footsteps from a mile away. Perfect. Guy in the middle here. Yo, how'd you know I was there, bro? Come on, man. That's a little sus. Got you again, Cookie Monster. I'm going for the flank. I'm going for the long route. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, dude, I ran out of ammo. You got so lucky right there, bro. So lucky. Sometimes, like, when you're playing of people of equal skill, the only thing that really makes a difference is uh, your ability to outsmart, man. It's all about strategy at this point. It's all about who wants it more. Low key, that's what it's about. Yeah, there's a guy right there. Look at him. Oh my goodness! Oh. Bro, he's so weak. Let's go. Ah, you got me. Not gonna use my kill streaks yet. They called in their VTOL. Yeah, you know what? Uh, we gotta get cover here. You know, that's fine if we take cover and we're not playing the objective right now. As long as uh, we still got that massive lead, it's not really gonna matter what's happening at this point. Good stuff, teammate. I'm pretty weak right now. Come on, man. You're using the EM2, man. You should be destroying me. Let's wait till that uh, V2 goes away. Or uh, whatever you call that thing, V toll. Oh, wow. That's probably not the smartest move. Ah, he's just camping. You know, the smartest thing to do, especially against good competition, is to save your streaks towards the very end until you really need it. Wait. Oh my goodness, man. LC10, always reliable. See what I did there? Use my, uh... Oh! oh ah! Pretty sure this guy's a little frustrated right now. Alright, let's, uh... Pop our UAV first. Ooh, they got a harp. Let's take ours out, too. And I'm going to use this. All right. Dude, they took out my harp super quick. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh! Oh, man. Come on. Yo, dude. These guys are pre-firing after the corners. Right before I'm even there. I don't know, man. I'm a little sus about that guy. Like, he knows my every move or something. Kind of weird. Turn around. Come on. Wait. Hard point 
Hello? Oh man, they got a gunship. No. Yo, we're literally like one point away here. One point away from winning. I would love to win. Come on. We gotta win. We gotta win. Oh, baby. <sighs> Come on, man. Finish off the game strong. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Someone was here. Yo, what? <clears throat> Bro, this guy just is so accurate. I, I don't understand, man. He knows where I'm coming from at all times. Pre-firing. It's just sus to me. All right, come on. Let's just finish off this game, dude. This, this is it. This is it. This is it. This is the end. This is the end. Let's go, baby. Let's get it. 56 and 23. Came out on top, man. It's a lot of sus plays here, dude, on the other team with that one guy. But, you know, whatever. I'll let it slide. It is what it is. We still won the game. Anyways, hopefully you guys did enjoy. Maybe we'll make this into a series, you know, where I just kind of, like, purposely look for sweats. Uh, cause man, dude, playing against these guys is super stressful. Don't get me wrong, but hopefully at the end of the day, it's your entertainment that I do care about. Leave a like if you did enjoy. Comment down below. You want to see more Cold War? Do it literally right now. I'm reading the comments. That's why I'm able to bring you guys these videos. And I can't do it without you guys' support and feedback. So I'll see you guys in the next one.